Welcome back guys. So the ultimate team of season is here. Um, no, I'm kind of late uh, for a gauge because, but I had to work long hours on both Friday and Saturday and I was sleeping when that glitch happened. Okay, if you guys don't know what glitch happened. Okay, let's go see these SBCs guys. You can see these SBCs are uh, whom am I missing? I'm missing a Timo Season Starter. And to get Timo Season Starters, we have to spend our hard and Timo Season vouchers. But guys, you can see because there's a condition like a zero year for Timo Season players in the bottom. But that one was not active for about five or five and a half hours. So everybody used uh, players like uh, Ruben Navas or says no no or uh, all those EFL starters and hell what can I say everybody who was online at that time they completed these SBCs easily guys and how many points are that I mean that's uh, okay that's one fifty three okay let's uh, let's go from here that's seven fifty. A thousand that's a thousand five hundred points guys one thousand five hundred points that is crazy guys and yes you could maybe for with that any f2p guys i have many f2p friends who go to players like this amazing messy card uh, could probably be the best striker in the game along with player of the month aguero i guess I had a great opinion about him, but yeah, guys, there's that. Anyone could get any of these cards using that glitch easily. I mean, it is possible even without the glitch. I will show you guys that in a minute, and that's the purpose of this guide. But guys, I wouldn't really go for any of these U-Tots cards unless you are some huge Leo Messi fan or something. Or even the Ramos and all, but guys, all these guys, uh, other than Messi and Ronaldo, everybody else have uh, great cards in Timo season itself. For Messi and Ronaldo, the skill boosts are not great in Timo season, and uh, it's better here. For example, you can you can see a ninety three Ramos here. There's a ninety two Ramos uh, there. For James, uh, for Hamas Rodriguez, there's a ninety five here and ninety three there. A uh, same boost, guys. Whether it be Hamas or I mean, for most players, the same boost, just one or two overall higher, and we have to pay a lot more of those vouchers for that. So, what to do with the demo season vouch, ultimate demo season vouchers? If I say that they are not worth it or they are too costly, guys, again another reason because if you say I want to try out maybe a Hummels or a Sergio Ramos, even. You don't, uh, and later on a date, uh, one week later, you feel like you're not happy with that card. You cannot change it because those are not tradable. What I do, guys, I would just do this one, guys. Trade them in for Timo season points, guys. Yes, and that's not bad. Uh, we got 87, and he was. During the glitch, everybody used him as a starter, but yeah, it's uh, it's gone now. The same happened with uh, Timo Zaire as well, guys. And can I say, the best way would be to use the ultimate Timo season uh, points and turn them into Timo season points, guys. And guys, everybody who did that during those five and a half hours, they would have uh, more than 2500 points. I'm talking about free to play guys. I'm talking about them only for the pay to play There would be a lot more obviously, but even the free to play could have got the 95 Messi 95 Ronaldo and 95 Zala and more guys Because that's 2500 points since Messi and Ronaldo share almost uh, a lot of points except say three 200 vouchers only that's like 600 points so combined Messi and Ronaldo would cost less than 1600 points then uh, 2500 means guys you could get Messi, Ronaldo and Salah 
means any free to play could get all three of these 95 rated cards using the glitch now without the glitch we could still get uh, Messi, Ronaldo and maybe a, I'm thinking maybe like someone like a Cruz or uh, maybe a Ramos if you're a fan guys if you're a fan of such a Ramos or a Griezmann or if you're a Barcelona fan maybe get a PK you could do all that using uh, the ultimate by doing the ultimate emojis and SBCs and then using those ultimate emojis and points to get the La Liga or English Premier League tokens so guys that would be the best way to use the ultimate points okay let's see now uh, I'm gonna do two, two or three of those SBCs now because well Without the glitch, it's a bit more hard, I would say. I have to get a few Timos and starters. Now here you can see, we need Timos and starters and Timos and resource and no EFL players. So we need known EFL Timos and uh, starters and the reserves. Let's uh, start with getting maybe five or six uh, Timos season reserves. I'm gonna open some packs and get uh, five or six Timos and reserves and then I uh, will talk more about that and guys the market well How can I say the market is kind of screwed because like I said guys earlier 195 over that's what uh, we were all getting but now it has become like uh, Anybody who use the glitch it's three for them those who don't use the glitch it's two for them so guys the price would uh, fall uh, i was expecting like a 40 million plus uh, earlier but now it would come down to i don't know i'm i'm hoping i could get uh, maybe 20 25 million of them i know it sounds crazy because let's say uh, you already have like 90 91 rated cards uh, above 30 million but if you see then Mohamed Zala card, the record breaker one, that's a 93 and it's going for, I don't know, something like a 16 million or 17 million. So, and these uh, with the glitch, the 95s would be a lot more common. So I'm not much hopeful of how much they would uh, get us. Maybe if you are able to sell just when they become auctionable, we may be able to get uh, maybe 40 million or 50 million. Uh, I'm hopeful of that. Otherwise, maybe we may have to wait for some time before we get a good price for them. Because guys, you have to remember that there are no base 94s in the game till this point. Because, well, wow, okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, finally, uh, some decent luck for us. Uh, that's a purple. I take purple any day, guys. Okay, guys, so... Okay, what was I saying? What was I talking? Yes, um, there are no base uh, 94s, guys, which means the 95s won't be needed as base for rank ups, which kind of uh, limits their usage in terms of uh, rank up items. But the 94s are going to come, guys. Uh, if it's not now, maybe in the World Cup or the later stages of the World Cup, they're gonna come. So even if the price falls, I uh, I hope it will rise again. I wouldn't sell my 95s for like a uh, 15 million or something, guys. The problem is that there will be a lot of people who would do that, and that kind of undercuts and reduces the market price. Uh, Dele Ali, who is always a bit of a nice guy, so not bad, guys. We opened like uh, two of those reserves and we go in. We could have got 83s uh, last time when we opened these. We are getting all 83s now. We got a 90 and an 88, so not bad. Okay, yeah, I haven't shown you guys all the requirements, guys. The SBCs are like first one is like I don't know 85 or 86 rated, 86, I think. The next one is um, 88, then 90, 91, and 92. Yes, you'll have to spend a few million coins and XP and everything for doing that, but I feel it's worth doing because, uh, well, it kind of, uh, if I look back someday and see, like, I got both, uh, I got some amazing players from 
okay not not bad 87 but i want something more maybe those 87s are not gonna be much useful for me in those sbz's i want 89 or more and guys i'm like a cheap p2p i won't be opening any of those 2000 fifa point vouchers only the 500 ones for me that also i'm not uh i won't be doing i'll open the bundesliga and the league one as well and i'll be skipping the calcio okay i'll be skipping the calcio one because i even if i open the one euro pack i still cannot open the guaranteed reserve because well i don't have the fifa points left my fifa points will be over uh, very soon and guys so is it better to get 195 or maybe a 93 and a 92 uh, instead of that again an 87 oh i want some 89s or something guys okay uh, again guys so that that is something because uh, a lot of the people would go for the 95 so there are chances like a 93s could uh, be more profitable i mean they're not going to be costlier than the 95 but considering the difference in vouchers required i kind of feel that they could actually be worth more in terms of what we invest and what we get back and again uh, 93s a lot of people ha ah, a 93 that's such a waste so yeah so the 92s and the 93s will be needed as rank up material so well their price may fall a bit when they become auctionable but i believe that the price would pick up sooner and uh, with world cup is coming which is like uh, well the biggest event in fifa we can expect uh, great things i mean of course definitely i'm pissed to the bug and everything but well there's no point in uh, being sad about it now it's uh, what's over it's over let's look forward to uh, what we can actually get and in this again you guys so uh, in this guaranteed node which is uh, kind of a free to play i got some nice ones uh, but this one i got an 83 again i spent fifa points and also i got like 83s and 87s and all that guys this is some uh, very nice amount of skill boost guys i'm gonna get, just get this 2000 skill boost as well if you choose between uh, messi and ronaldo messi would be worth more coins i believe because ronaldo just had a pair of the month as well but guys the Ronaldo gives like 2000 skill boost guys that's uh, that's huge for me that's huge for anybody who has uh, say less than 15 plus 15 uh, on the skill boost level Messi would give like uh, 5 million coins whereas 2000 skill boost would be worth like uh, 10 million so that's like we are gaining uh, 5 million here but if you want coins uh, more than Messi gives 5 million and he may actually go for more coins as well. Guys, if you're some uh, crazy about any player, okay, it's 30 into speed, that's nice. If you're crazy about uh, any player, in, uh, any particular player, like Messi or Ronaldo or something, then you toads, although the ultimate toads is uh, good. Otherwise, guys, I would uh, suggest you guys to do this one. That taking doing those SBCs, taking those points, and instead of uh, spending it there, take it here, guys. Convert them into La Liga points or EPL points. Actually, you may see. Uh, I don't know. I mean, the market's uh, really difficult to predict at the moment because there'll be so many undercutters and all. I mean, undercutters means uh, people who sell them less. 
I mean, you may think that uh, you're going to uh, sell them for 25 million and then other other people who come and sell them for 15. But I kind of get a feeling that the 93s like uh, James Rodriguez, they would be a lot closer to the 95s in terms of praise than uh, earlier expected. I was expecting the praise of 95s to be more than double or uh, that of 93s but now I'm not I don't think there will be that much difference at least uh, with the guys like uh, James Rodriguez who is uh, probably the best cam in the game or a central like midfielder in the game the guys so we get uh, 2000 of those points and we need some more points for getting Ronaldo but how do we get those well, we need star pass, guys. That's where the glitch came into play. Now that they have removed the glitch, we need to get starters. So these are the starters I'm going to get, guys. The cheapest ones I'm going to get. Rabiot and Fabinho. Because these are uh, the cheapest ones you could get. The 86ers and then after that, guys, Many of those, if you check the vouchers needed, many of those 87s and 88s uh, seem to need like same amount of uh, points. So I'm going to get a couple of 86s and then I think I'll get three 88s because if 88s and 87s are going to cost the same amount of vouchers, then we save some coins and experience points by choosing the 88s ahead of the 87s. There's a uh, common logic, obviously. Okay, here we go. We get. Uh, I didn't want the video to be too long. That is why I, I even opened those EFL packs and all offline, but uh, still it's uh, a little bit long, but. Uh, it's because uh, there's uh, so much I have to talk as well. So guys, uh, and I wouldn't tell you guys like go and get this guy like uh, get Messi or get Cruz or get Hammers Rodriguez. That you guys have to decide guys. I'm just showing you guys that you could get a lot more points uh, doing this. Okay, let's say how much uh, you could get. Even though you spend these points, you will uh, you still still have more than uh, two thousand points, I believe, uh, doing this way, which should be enough to claim. I think uh, maybe no Messi and Zala. Who knows? Uh, or even go and claim uh, the Neymar and uh, James Rodriguez and Cruz and whatever you guys want, guys. Just me. What I mean is, if you use these thousand five hundred. Ultimate Timo season points for the normal Timo season nodes. You would try those players out, and if they are if they are not what you hope they were, they would be. Then you could actually sell them. I always uh, like to have that option because some players uh, tend out to be a disappointment, and in that case, this helps a lot. Guys, this is the first SBZ. I know I could, instead of party, I could uh, use someone else. Okay, maybe I'll change party, I think, because he's actually uh, seemed to be performing uh, decent in game. So maybe someone else. Okay, who else? Uh, Cal Troyan. Uh, okay, Marcel is all the clear. Cal Troyan, Voland. Guys, so we need one starter, which is uh, Rabio, and then there's Roland and Adan. So, and there is no EFL players. Okay, we're gonna trade them in. We get like uh, 50 of those points. The 50 points, the first one is in great. The first one or the second one, I wouldn't say these are great, but doing all of these guys, getting like that. Uh, something like 1500 points I think it is and getting that much that is a uh, huge because 
we need like 1600 for uh, Messi plus Ronaldo or like I said I am Messi plus Ronaldo because I kind of uh, like the feel like when I look back into I already have a like 118 team so getting FIFA champion or any of that is uh, not a big deal for me anymore but when I look back I, have, I want to see like I had uh, like our let's say I got uh, when I look back into Timo's season like I got guys like uh, Messi and Ronaldo that would be kind of nice okay we need 88 overall which means we can have 187 and 288 okay I trained him up uh, actually I trained both of them up and we need that 86 starter where is he yes uh, Fabinho I need to train Fabinho up by one level so 86 to 87 uh, we have to spend like uh, 66k XP and okay that's 65 I need uh, a lot more I oh, know I'll throw in some okay there's 200 more I need I always try to minimize the excess XP or the wastage or whatever we call it. Yes, uh, we don't lose any XP. We are going to spend in. Uh, I mean, we are losing like uh, 67k XP, of course. Well, he goes, there he go. He becomes 87. Uh, that SBC should be doable now. there you go always try to minimize uh, it guys like for 88 don't use uh, 388 guys use a couple of 88s and use an 87 because I mean why waste XP or coins or whatever it is extra we should try to minimize our expenses and maximize our what we gain Here the network seem to be slow. I hope I don't get logged out. Okay, I didn't. That's nice. That's another hundred points. So the next one, guys. Then now it's uh, it will start to get tricky, I guess, uh, because I think this one requires like ninety overall team. Yes. This means uh, I need a couple of 90s and 89. Okay, I'm not going to use uh, Busquets yet. Okay, that's Galahon and uh, Max. A couple of those are trained up. Now I need another starter. I'm going to get uh, Lacomte from League One. Because, well, I had done everything up to the first reserve node already. So after that, I need like uh, 5, 15, 25 points for the 88 overall. And guys, for 87, that's again 25. So if you can get an 87 or 88 for 25 points, then I choose 88. I, this is also another reason why I'm a bit late to do the video. Uh, because I was doing a lot of uh, maths. I mean, uh, which one would be more useful, which place, which uh, status to choose to minimize our voucher expenses, uh, which would be more beneficial, the u tolls or the tolls, and uh, hearing uh, reviews from my friends as well who took the tolls players. Tolls, u tolls, Messi, uh, the ultimate team of season Messi, he, uh, everybody says great reviews about him, but then again, uh, if you are a diehard fan, then maybe go for it. But if you care more for overall, then ultimates are not the way to go. So we got a couple of 90s. We need to get him to 89 so that we can use him as the starter in that one. 
I wouldn't be doing the last two SBCs yet. I have already uh, chosen the players I want to use uh, in them. Okay, what an idea in iron. I already uh, finalized which players I want to use guys. Again, you can see 290 is an 89 makes a 90 team. I won't be using the base 90 plus uh, players uh, for these SBCs. I'm gonna wait and snipe some 89s cheap and uh, train them up and sell my uh, 90 buskets maybe. And I know the trades are a bit up at the moment, mostly because, uh, well, a lot of people are buying them uh, for putting them into these SBCs. Here we get ultimate point, guys. That is... Okay, let's go to me. The next one is, guys, we need a 91 overall team and a 92 overall team. Guys, you can see... I got 360 of those uh, La Liga, I mean, oh, sorry, not La Liga, the ultimate team of season points, guys. When I convert them into La Liga points, I will have about 120. I need only 100 for getting that Ronaldo, so that Ronaldo is already ensured. Okay, guys, hope you guys find this video helpful. If you guys have any comments, or uh, if you guys uh, have any suggestions like uh, what I should improve and all, um, free to listen. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye. I hope you guys make the most out of this video. And again, once again, I'm sorry that if you guys, some of you already spent the vouchers and couldn't do this. Well, like I said, there were circumstances which prevented me from uh, doing it earlier i even considered like uh, leaving it uh, the game because uh, it happened for team of the year and it ha again happened for the team of season the two biggest events well the bag and uh, have to sleep and have to if that is if the game reaches a point where we have to compromise on our uh, sleeping pattern and all when that is when it becomes dangerous. So then I thought about it and I'm taking it casually now. Hope they don't uh, mess up the World Cup because it's the biggest event and now all hopes uh, lies in the World Cup guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. See you guys later.